when life gives you lemons, make lemon bars. Lemon bars are for sure in my top five favorite desserts of all time. It starts with just some flour, about half a cup of sugar, and a cup of softened butter. And I'm just gonna mix this together until it's slightly moist and crumbly. This is reminiscent of what you would see in a shortbread crust, same flavor and texture. Now I just go in to an ungreased baking dish. The pan I'm using is slightly smaller than a nine by 13, but I did that on purpose so that I get a thick crust because the crust is my favorite part. This dough will come together easily with just a fork. The mixer just makes it faster, but whatever you wanna do is fine with me. Because once you press it in, it all sticks together just like a dough. I'm just gonna bake this at 350 for 15 minutes while I make my filling. We're timing it so that we make our filling while our crust is in the oven because you wanna pour your filling over a hot crust. So you don't wanna do your crust too far in advance. We're making something very similar to a lemon curd, but we're not cooking it on the stovetop. It's all kind of cooking together in the oven. So the ingredients for that are super simple. You just need the juice from two lemons. This is not a time to use that stuff in the plastic bottle. It's not the same. You'll know your lemons are really juicy when you can squeeze them easily. If they come out a little bit tough, give them a little roll first and that'll release some of the juices. Into the bowl, one and a half cups of sugar with a quarter cup of flour. This is gonna help thicken it. Whisk those two together first, then add in our eggs and lemon juice. It smells so good. If you wanna add extra lemon flavor, you can always add some of that zest from those lemons. I'm gonna save it for a little bit of a topping. Did you know it was this easy to make lemon bars? It smells buttery. Now straight onto that hot crust, I'm gonna pour our filling, then back in the oven for 20 more minutes. So easy. Hot out of the oven. Now we gotta let it cool completely. Our lemon bars have set and cooled and they're ready to be sliced. Lemon bars are very sticky, so it helps if you dip your knife into some hot water before slicing. And what's a lemon bar without the powdered sugar topping? Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at the layers. I can definitely see why this is our top rated lemon bar recipe. These are so good and could not be any easier to make. These are perfect. Why don't I make these all the time? 